Hey gang, this is Andy over at Falco Canine Academy. Uh, thanks for um, coming to the second video in the series of videos of questions that you should ask uh, before committing to a trainer or training facility. Uh, and this is a, kind of an interesting thing and uh, you could ask them but nobody's going to be able to say yes other than maybe us. But <laughs> uh, are you licensed by any state or federal government? And here's the issue with that. There's no governing body that licenses uh, any dog trainer, I don't care if it's a police dog trainer, detection dog trainer, or pet dog trainer, therapy dog trainer, uh, agility dog trainer, uh, there's no governing body that watches over what is going on in the dog industry. Uh, the only governing body that there is in the dog industry, I think, may be the dog food industry. Uh, but as far as taking care of uh, your dog in the training um, area, nothing. There's no licensing whatsoever. Now, Falco Canine Academy does have two federal licenses, and these are very important licenses because they're not easy to get. As a matter of fact, you probably won't find any other training facility that has both of them and is insured uh, by, uh, you know, with our Workman's Comp and with the Hartford Company. Uh, very unusual, I was going to say very weird. <laughs> But no, it's very unusual, uh, not normal, um, but we do have a license through DEA and a license through the ATF, and that's through our training of detection dogs. And very difficult to get. Many of the big trainers that I know in this area have lost their licenses or never even bothered to get them because they can't for some reason or another. But we have both, uh, very unusual. Uh, again, we are um, uh, insured. We also are uh, certified by the state of California to um, to test and certify police dogs uh, and detection dogs for law enforcement. So we have that certification. It's not necessarily a license because uh, the certification is voluntary. It's not mandated by the state of California. And you, I'm sure you find that strange also, that any police dog that's out there can just go out there and be a police dog. There's, there's no mandatory uh, license certification for a dog to be on the street. Very odd, I know. But we've gone out and we've done everything we can to show uh, our folks and to make sure that uh, we have been tested in every uh, fashion possible. And so we do have federal, two federal licenses. We are certified by the state of California and um, we are insured. So uh, have faith in that. Anywhere else you go, they're not gonna probably be able to say yes to any of those things, uh, except for maybe being insured, but that's even hard to get uh, on its own. So I hope that was helpful. Uh, but uh, again, um, you know, that's not the end all be all, but it is very important for you to know about us that we have those uh, credentials. All right, take care, hope that was helpful. We'll see you on the next one.